Fresno State Bulldogs have journeyed to Oahu, Hawaiian for the gathering place. The Hawaiian Islands are the product of Mother Nature's unyielding forces some 25 million years ago. The Hawaiian war chant and its rhythmic beat echo the tradition and spirit of proud and native warriors. The goal is to capture that dauntless spirit. Today, Colorado and Fresno State will pierce the peaceful Pacific sunrise in the Jeep Eagle Aloha Bowl. ABC Sports College Football is proud to present the 1993 Jeep Eagle Aloha Bowl. Featuring the Fresno State Bulldogs from the Western Athletic Conference and the Colorado Buffaloes out of the Big 8 Conference. And hey, Santa Claus got delayed. Just underway here in the first quarter of the Jeep Eagle Aloha Bowl. Dilfer to pass. Hits the out pattern complete for the first down to number six, Lee Harris. Lee Harris, another one of those solid guys. He's a senior. They say he's probably the most solid of all the receivers. 31 catches. Backs out of the eye this time. Salam again. Brought down at the line of scrimmage. A good surge that time on the right side by Fresno State. Gene Smith leading the way. The least points that Fresno State has scored in a game this year, 28. So you know, or you fully expect them to score a lot of points. Hill for play action on second and eight. Completes it to Malcolm Seabrun at the 35 and a first down for the Bulldogs. Five yard line, 7.56 to play in the first quarter. The Buffaloes lead seven to nothing. Dilfer over the middle to Dunn, juggles it, hangs on to it, and is down at the 41-yard line. Tackled by Sam Rogers. Their quarterback right here this afternoon to Trent Dilfer. They trail, though, 10-0. He completes the pass again. Who else? David Dunn with a first down out to the 36-yard line. A pickup of 16. He's tackled by Enriquez. Dilfer down to that low play clock. Rivers to single back, three wide receivers, and he hits Charlie Jones, the sophomore. Jones out to the 47-yard line, and he's near a first down, and yes, he has it, a pickup of 15 yards. He missed three games with a bad ankle, but now one of the more experienced players today in the second game. They blitz again, but this time, Dilfer finds David Dunn up the middle, complete to the 43-yard line, and a pickup of 23 yards. Somehow these guys have to break the ice. I mean, they're moving up and down the field, but don't have any points. Very much team players as well. Three wideouts for the Bulldogs. The blitz. Dilfer gets rid of it. What a heads-up play by Trent Dilfer. And Rivers makes it down to the 12. He's tackled by Ted Johnson. But Dilfer says, hey, how do you like that, Buffaloes? <laughs> yeah, Dilfer gets up. From the corners to bring a Wolf Fork and Rodgers. Derek Mahonian now to attempt a field goal from 27 yards out. And he splits the uprights. Four clock manager. Backside pressure, and Stewart is down at the 34. A blitz by Stoutmeyer, and Stewart is sacked. And that may, may have taken them out of field goal range. We'll have to see. 11 seconds to play in the first half now. I can't believe that. They used it about 20 seconds just to get a This will be the last play of the first half. Jamie Christian for Fresno State tries to lateral it. And he does. Seabrook. From Zebra, no flags! Merry Christmas, Bulldogs! Do you believe it? Yeah. Dilfer's hit only one of his last seven passes. Wolfork in on the pressure, but the pass is completed at the 42-yard line. And a first down to Charlie Jones. The blitz coming, Dilfer gets rid of it. And what a grab by Daigle. Oh, he showed the heart of a lion into the teeth of the zone to hang on. Gain of 27. Play was set up by Dilfer again. Fake the draw. Slid him through the And catch. They come out of their T-heavy formation. Touchdown! They run it. No signal as of yet. And yes, now it's a touchdown. Anthony Daigle. 
Oh, we've had a great week. Every uh, time the football players are on me in jovial situations, like after the game or whatever, they get this thing going, Sweeney, shake your booty, booty, booty. And then when they do that, I might do anything. So the first night we're here, I'm down by the pool. The players are all up there in the hotel. Everybody's about ready to go to bed at 10.30, and all the players out on the balcony say, Sweeney, shake your booty, booty, booty. They got me fired up, and I dove in the pool. But the hearing aids, the wallet, at all. <laughs> Rivers out of bounds at the 13-yard line and a first down for the Bulldogs. Still plenty of time left for this offense. They're explosive. Built for the pass. Complete at the 39-yard line. Another catch for Lee Harris. He's had a great day. <laughs> Looks like one of those guys in those old digit movies. Here's a pass complete to Anthony Tangle down to the 16. And another first down for Fresno State. They've enjoyed themselves this week. 2.15 to play now. Dilfer complete to Jones. He laid that right in there, too. That ball was perfectly thrown. Bill McCartney in line to notch his second bowl victory of his career. Bingo. A quick slant and a touchdown for Fresno State. That ball was perfectly thrown to Titus Winus.